Yeah. Uh, I had a cool experience happen to me this week, and uh, Tim asked me if I'd share tonight. And uh, I had to man up and do it, so <laughs> here we are. But <clears throat> uh, basically, just a real quick testimony of what happened with me and a friend of mine. Uh, we've been friends here for the last few years, on and off. I see him here and there at restaurants, and we see him on the golf course every now and then. And uh, I can tell he's been really hurt and really struggling in life, his job and family and everything. And about four months ago, I asked him if he wanted to go to Bible study with me, and he said he would. And uh, he went with me, and everything went pretty good. And I hadn't heard from him in, in four months. And then uh, last week, he called me up again and said, man, I'm sorry for the, the kind of friend that I've been. And, and uh, I need to talk to somebody. So I called him up. We talked a little bit, and he said, when are you going to a Bible study again? I said, well, I'm going on Monday night. He said, you're welcome to come with me. So we uh, met, and uh, he called me down, and we went to a little Bible study down in Jackson, just way out in the country. Went to the Bible study. It was great. They had a, they had a little short call for, you know, um, at the end, if anybody wanted to get saved. He didn't make a move. He didn't move. He didn't say a word. And I was just like, no problem, you know, we'll just let things go and let things happen. So as we're walking to the truck later that night, it was just me and him. And uh, he made a couple of comments, and, you know, I kind of asked him, well, what, what do you mean by that? And so he said a few more things, and uh, basically I just started sharing with him and, and giving my testimony and stuff. And, and he asked a pretty, pretty serious question. He said, how do you know when you're ready for God? And, and another thing that he kept hitting on this, you know, why, why am I where am I, why am I at this point in my life? Why, how come I'm struggling and so on and so forth? And I said, well, I said, from what I can tell, God has you right here at this place tonight for, for a reason. And so I started sharing with him, and we were talking out in this field. It was about 1030 at night. It was, it was dark as can be after that big rain came through that night. And while we're talking and sharing, and I, I kid you not, it was, a, it was a miracle from God. We're out there. I can't even see him. He's a couple of feet in front of me. Out of the blue, a light shines down out of the sky. And it lit up the area around us. I could see him playing today. He could see me. <clears throat> and I could see the car. And as soon as it came, we both kind of looked up. And then it was gone, just like that. Just a boom, a little flash of light was all over us. And we're out in the deep woods down in Jackson. There ain't no lights, no nothing. <laughs> and so we talked a little bit further. Another gentleman that was there that night, his name's Barron. He came walking by and said, Barron, come here. And I, I, I told him the question that Todd had. How do you know when you're ready? So he shared a little bit, and I shared a little bit, and, and Todd made the decision right there to accept Christ in his life. And he got saved right there on the spot. And it was just, it was an awesome thing. And so we're finishing up, I'm going to the car, and I reach down in my pocket, and I pull out my little card right here. I said, Ty, you ain't gonna believe this. I said, I've been working on this this verse, you know, all week. You know, so I kind of, I went over it with him, and then I, when I got to verse 6, I said, this is what it said. And I wanted to show it to him. I didn't want to just quote it and make him think I was making it up, so I read it right to him, and I read it right there on verse 6. For God who said, let light shine out of darkness. And I tell you, it just got all over him and got all over me, and it was a great night. I just want to share that with you guys. That's Amen. Awesome. Woo!